New at 6, concerned parents in the Pittsburgh Public School District are speaking out. As we've been covering, temperatures hit the 90s this week. Many schools don't have air conditioning. Now, supposedly, they're being told don't open the classroom windows. Erica Stanish explains why. Yeah, students here at Greenfield have been learning remotely for the past two days due to extreme heat. And some parents tell me that when they return to the classroom tomorrow, the heat's going to remain a problem because apparently they can't open any of the windows. We have a very clear problem here and it just feels like nothing's being done. Into just their second week of school, 38 schools within the Pittsburgh Public School District are learning from home due to extreme heat. And adding to it, those at Greenfield apparently can't even open the windows once they're back inside. The school doesn't have air conditioning, which happens. You know, many of the buildings don't, but because of the lantern flies, the kids are complaining that the windows can't be opened. This parent who didn't want to be identified tells us his elementary students have been complaining about the temperatures inside and says the building has been surrounded by this six legged invasive insect best known as a lantern fly. And it's just making it so much more difficult. It'll be hot either way, but having that option and I just feel like there's no solutions being sought out. He says he's contacted the district and hopes to find a solution to the problem, even coming up with some of his own. We could just get a roll of screen and tape it over. It could, there's probably miles of screen and a PPS uh, warehouse somewhere. But he claims his complaints have gone ignored. And now students district wide are set to return back to the classroom tomorrow. And parents say they hope PPS will make safety their top priority. It's not the principal's fault, it's not the teacher's fault. There's a lot of higher ups that are paid a lot of money to see problems, foresee problems, address problems as they come up, find solutions, and we're in one of those situations. And I'm guess reaching out to get some action. Now, I reached out to Pittsburgh Public Schools to learn what they're doing to address the problem, and I have not heard back yet. Reporting in Greenfield, Erica Stanish, KDKA TV News.